Uh, Patrick Reeder. Um, why, yeah, last year's YCS London champion. Uh, you ended up top 32 at YCS London this year. Yeah. You played Shuttles, of correct? Of course, the best deck. Yeah, pretty much. Um, yeah, is there anything you want to say before you go to the Degrafa? Um, first, I would like to say that uh, London is always a great city. Uh -huh. And uh, as the Comic Con is also at the weekend, it's also super fine. And also thanks to uh, my team that inspired the deck pretty much right. and uh, the people that lend me cards like Chipluck and yeah. all the Austrians. Alright, yeah, let's see the deck. So, let's start. So, I played three Mathematician, pretty standard. Oh. Three Beasts, also pretty standard. Two Chaos Sorcerer. Uh -huh. These were uh, the boss monsters that you need in the deck and that is too greedy because if you draw it late it's dead but one dark, one light you have almost every time. Yes. So, two Moral Tuch. Uh, we played two Moral Tuch, that was Peter's idea uh -huh. uh, because you don't draw them that often and uh, most of the time one Sanctum gets always countered like Trap Stun or Biotap so you don't draw them uh, that often then. Right. Okay. then to Lala. Uh, Lila, because you want to destroy the uh, main deck Shadow Mirrors and also um, Emptiness, and uh, it's light for Sorcerer and DLS, so it's fine. Yeah. To Effect Whaler. Uh, Effect Whaler is a pretty interesting card in this format because most of the times my deck uh, wouldn't want to start because uh, if you don't start, you're minus one, yes. and if your opponent negates uh, your first play, like Mathematician, with Effect Whaler, you're so much behind because yes. you play greedy cards like Burst Rebirth, Shadow Games, all, all of them are uh, much better if you have one card more and your effect goes through or you can have one more card to play. So, to Skomada, to Falco, to Hedgehog, one Dragon, one Dragon because I played Lila, so uh -huh. you don't need the second. And the best card, Yellas. Okay. Just the monsters. The spells. The spells. Free shuttle fusion. Of course. Free, uh, one super yeah. poly and one foolish. Super standard. Nothing to say here. <laughs> so the traps. Yes. Free artifact sanctum. Of course, if you play moral talk, you have to play sanctum because it's the best trap card in the game. Free sinister shadow games. Two when it is emptiness. We played only two when it is emptiness because uh, we didn't have enough, okay? But uh, we also had um, had planned to play Solemn Warning because it's better against Black Rose summons oh, yes. and you don't have to activate it preemptively. Yeah. Uh, so then, one break for skill. We only played one break for skill for the Effect Whalers. One Solemn Warning. One Wiretap. We played Wiretap because Trap's done. Uh, you activate Sanctum and he trap stuns and you wiretap so yeah. your Sanctum goes yeah, through. So yeah. Then one Shuttle Core. Shuttle Core is especially important in the mirror match and also against Burning Abyss. In the mirror match it's a um, restless battle, therefore if you activate fusion with Shuttle Core and one monster, you get the fusion directly back and if the fusion dies, yeah. you get the Shuttle Core. So you only need one strong monster per fusion. And one burst rebuff right. because if you start mathematician into squamada beasts and you have this card it's Ooh. so bonkers yeah. <laughs> right that, that was the main deck yeah 40 cards of course so then the side deck yeah it's fine to razor for the stone buff because if you start uh, if your opponent starts game two because you let him start or he wants to start, you storm for his uh, set monster with shadow games and then you have Razor. Or if he uh, has only one shot all, you tribute for Razor, activate shadow games, he doesn't get effect because it's in the deck at the result. Or it would be. Yeah. So one Felice, Cancer. Um, <laughs> I boarded it once the whole tournament. <laughs> yeah. Our plan was to board it in matchups where you can uh, have death draws, like uh, rogue matchups, gear gear, and so on. I bought it one time against Lightsworn, and of course I drew it in my opening hand. You tried. <laughs> Don't play this card. <laughs> uh, two stone buff. Yeah, for the combo. And you have like five tribute monsters in the main deck, so it's never Why really not? dead. To Mystical Space Stephon for Sotella and uh, all of the floodgates. One Regiki. Regiki is super good. It's good against Burning Abyss because 
they uh, hide behind their Dante Seer combo and you can Regiki do something and push for damage. Also, if they overextend with BLS or Chaos Sorcerer or something, you just Regiki them and also against rope decks. Uh, on mind control, awesome in the mirror match, otherwise not needed. Two trap stuns against Burning Abyss and uh, one to two against uh, Sotellas to uh, handle their back row and black rows. Two dimensional prison, uh, really good against rope decks, really good in the timeout and also pretty good against the uh, fiends, the Majestics and yeah, Vanity Fiends. So. Yeah. And one rivalry of the world. Never bought it this card, but it should be good against the rogue decks, but you don't need it most of the time. So this card and also the Felis could be other cards. Nice. Okay. Extra deck. So free El Shovel Construct, standard to Shovel Winder. So then one Leo. One Crimson Blader, we played Crimson Blader over the second rank 4 exceed because we played Sorcerer and Shadol uh, and Shadol Park of the Sorcerer, Crimson Blader, sometimes you need it but I never summoned it. Arcanite, Michael, best Trinko monster in the game right now because one Moral Tuff, one Parko, Michael, you get to banish one card and mill three cards, yeah. it's so awesome. Black Rose, Goyo, Armadas. Castell, Durandal, it's uh, good because if you ha can go for game and you make Durandal, you can't do anything about your, your going for game. And also it negates fusion or shuffles back your dead cards. Nice. And one Walker Saurus. Yeah. Alright, uh, yeah, Patrick, any last words? Yeah, it was pretty fun. I went 11 and 0, so yeah, and the deck, has, yeah. deck has to be good. <laughs> yeah, definitely. And uh, yeah, as I said, thanks to all uh, people who know me and all my opponents. All right, yeah, Patrick. Uh, thanks for the deck profile and congrats with your top 32 spot here at YZ.